What is going on, anglers of all sorts? It's your boy, Kavari Tech Media, AKA Caleb here. And guys, welcome back to another kayak fishing adventure. We're back again today in the marsh, and we have the very first cold snap that just hit the panhandle of Florida. And I am super stoked. That means the redfish, the speckled trout, the hybrid bass, everything is fixed and start moving into the marsh, moving into the rivers, and it is amazing. I love this time of year. The sheep's head start biting. It is a phenomenal time to fish in my area this time of year. And guys, I could not be any more stoked than what I am. Um, went a couple days ago, as you guys are about to see, and it was one of the best days of fishing I have had in a minute, guys. Was only able to fish for about three and a half hours, and I caught numerous fish. I caught four keepers. Um, I probably lost them. But, I mean, I caught tons and tons of speckled trout, caught some redfish, black drum, you name it, guys. Was really bummed I couldn't fish longer, but I had to work and I had to head in early. But all in all, a phenomenal day, guys. I'm really stoked to share this uh, adventure with you guys. But do me a favor, if y'all do enjoy the video, leave a like. If you guys enjoy the video all the way through, make sure y'all subscribe. And guys, if y'all have any type of questions regarding fall fishing or just fishing in general, let me know in the comment section down below and I'll do my best to answer them to my knowledge. So, with all further ado, I'm going to let y'all enjoy the YouTube video and y'all have a blessed day. Peace out, guys. guys something just uh i just saw something feed on something right up in that grass oh there we go first freaking cast first cast guys oh my god this looks like a nice trout it is a nice trout there we go oh my gosh you freaking booger are you serious Oh my goodness gracious. All right guys, I think there's like a major trout feeding frenzy up ahead. I'm gonna try and keep my, I'm gonna try and keep my distance, but the one I just lost was probably a keeper. He was probably right at 15. There he is. Got him. That's a better fish. That might be a red. If that's a trout, that's a nice trout, guys. There we go, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Nice, nice trout. Oh yeah, that is a nice trout. Come here, baby. Oh, baby. That's what I'm talking about, guys. That is a nice trout. Super nice trout. Oh, he's definitely legal. For sure, guys. Oh my God, check it out too. He freaking inhaled that gulp. Oh, that's a solid one. Awesome. Pinch the tail. Oh yeah. That's a nice 16 inch right there, folks. Good way to, good way to start the morning. Let's put him in the cooler and let's get back to fishing. It's my first keeper spec in a long time, especially out here. All right, let's try this this point right here. These apex points, guys, are great places. Not sure if y'all could tell, but the last spot where I caught that trout, that was also a, a uh, apex point. Let that sink a little bit. Oh, nice fish. There we go, baby. Gotta get the hook in them better. There we go, guys. That feels like a good fish. Come on, please be a keeper, Red. Oh yeah, that's a good fish. That's a good fish, baby. That's a good fish, guys. No, nice. I think it's a red or a black drum. 
I think it's a drum actually, guys. I think it's a drum. Oh, it's a nice eating size black drum. That is what I'm talking about, baby. Woo, he's not done yet either, guys. He ain't done. Nice. Get in the boat. Come on. Come on, dude. What are you doing, ugly? Come on, there you go. Yes, 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 yes. That's how we do it, guys. First cast on this little point right there. It is a nice black drum, perfect eating size. Oh my gosh. That is what I am talking about, baby. The fall bite is here. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, yes. That is a nice 21 inch fish right there, folks. Beautiful 21 inch fish. Let's put him in the cooler. But check him out, guys. Beautiful marsh drum right there. He, he'll be good eating. I'm gonna go ahead and put him in the ice chest. All right. That is how we do it, guys. First cast on that little apex point right there. And, uh, nice fish beautiful black drum second one i've caught in this area that one was actually a little bit bigger than the first one i caught but beautiful beautiful marsh drum those, those guys eat really well too there's got to be some fish at this little spot guys check it out this wind is blowing all that water right off this little bend right here oh there we go what i tell you Nice fish. What is this? There we go. There we go. I don't know if he's going to make the cut. It'll be extremely close, guys. There we go. That's a red. That's a red. Don't know if he's going to make it, though. We shall see. No, I don't think he's going to make it, guys. I think he's going to be a little short. Once again, though, that wind is blowing all that water right off this little bend. And it's just a pretty common sense spot for a predator to kind of hang out. Gulp is out. Yeah, I don't think he's gonna, I don't think he's gonna make it, guys. Yeah, he's 16 inches, but. But that's definitely the best red of the day so far. Come here, guy. Beautiful little marsh red. Let's go ahead and get a release on him. All right, awesome. Oh yeah, baby. Good fish. Good fish. Another black drum. What in the world? Another black drum, baby. That's what I'm talking about. Woo! Golly, this one is like... This one is freaking... He is mad. Where's my... There we go. Check out the stripes on this guy too. Awesome. <laughs> Baby. Kavari Tech Media is eating the night, folks. That is our second drum right there. Awesome. Oh yeah. I think this guy might have like fought harder than that first one. And he's definitely not as big. He's probably 18 or 19 inches, but another beautiful drum. Awesome awesome fish right there guys he's going in the ice box though he's definitely 18 black drum have a slot oh any drum over about 24 25 inches guys i don't recommend uh eating though because they start to get worms and not only that but those are the ones that start to breed so you don't want to keep them too big in my honest opinion all right 
awesome fish right there let's put him in the cooler and let's get back to fishing guys that's two drum and a speck and an almost legal redfish still hunting for that red but i think we will get it done all right guys once again we have an apex point up here i just saw something get blown up on this point not sure what it was it almost looked like a trout but we're fixing to go up here and cast our bait this right here is what you're looking for guys and that is a perfect spot too because not only is it a point but it's a wind blown point because the wind's coming at me right now so that right there is like just money if you can find that more likely than not you're gonna find the fish so let's go see if there is a fish hanging out here after all there we go first freaking cast first cast guys i think this is a trout i think it's a trout if it's a trout i called it it is a trout there we go i think that might be another keeper too oh, oh no dang it dang it dang it dang it there you have it what did i tell you guys i thought i saw a trout blow up and a wind blown point is what you are freaking looking for gosh that looked like another legal trout he was probably right at 15. there we go nice if this is a trout guys this is a nice nice freaking trout oh my god it is too there we go guys that is a nice one he's probably keeper that's what i'm talking about Whoo! another solid trout you know not huge but just all in all perfect size to eat and the ones that actually give you a decent fight this trout don't fight that hard let's get this guy measured up make sure he's 15. he might not you know these guys are you think they're like right at 15 and all of a sudden you measure them and they're like 14 and three fourths so always got to measure them just to make sure i'm not sure if y'all can see that let me hop over here guys i think he is going to be like barely barely short i'm he might even be right at 15 inches guys but i'm not gonna risk it i'm just gonna let him go thank you for the catch buddy oh dang it guys i was so set on that thing being legal but like i said these trout in here are fat so whenever you catch them you know they look like they're a lot bigger than what they usually are all right let's get another bait out i think i found the trout once again now folks got him Good fish, good fish, good fish. Good fish. Oh, nice red, baby. Nice red fish. He's gonna be keeper. He's gonna be keeper, guys. For sure. Oh yeah, baby. There's our red, guys. There's our red. That's a good one too. Oh, come here, buddy. Get in the net. Woo! That's what I'm talking about. Yes, baby. Woo -hoo -hoo! There's our redfish, guys. Oh my god. Nice. Nice. Oh, check it out. Oh my gosh, what a fish what a fish guys let me get him off the hook all right guys let's get him measure up he's probably 23 22 and almost a half 22 and one fourth guys or all right let's just call him 22. that right there is the slot red of the day that is how we do it folks
Golly, the bite is just on fire today, guys. That cold snap, just it really did ignite things here. Oh my God, that is awesome. Awesome, awesome. All right, I'm gonna toss him in the bag and we are going to continue to fish, guys. Awesome, awesome fish right there. Woo!